In this lecture, we will use the service bean inside our test class and see if it got wired properly. Before we do that, let's move this service to a new sub package, create a new package under Spring Boot dot service. That's where our service belongs. Move the service there. Okay. In the test class, I can rename this context loads to test service. And to get the beans, we need to auto wire application context. Context mark it with at auto wired. In most of the real time applications, we'll be developing web applications and we rarely have to do this. We use Spring MVC mock tests, etc., which I'll show you when we do the web development piece using Spring Boot. Inside the test service, context dot get bean pass in the class name which is service dot class hit control one and import that service class from our own package control one again assign statement to a new local variable call it service service dot the only method we have in there is save invoke that method and that's all we need to do you can assert for multiple things but in this case we just want to see the output so right click run as junit test and that finishes successfully as you know if you go here it's all green and if you go to the console you should be able to see this text called created so copy that go to the console control f paste that and search for this is service being created, but you search again and you see this text here, which says created, which is coming from the DAO. So all our beans are successfully wired and we see the proper output. In the next lecture, I will explain the flow once again, end to end, what exactly is happening, how, the, how are the beans getting wired and how the Spring Boot application is starting and executing.